First up on Elections Unlocked, we are turning to Odisha because that's where Prime Minister Modi is making his latest pitch. He's there uh, in Odisha today uh, as part of his 12-state trip, a hectic whistle-stop tour across the country. Uh, he will be in 12 states over the next week. Today in Odisha, he was inaugurating development projects worth over 19,600 crores. But as you can see in the visuals on your screen in a moment, it was a day once again where he shared the stage with his frenemy, as they call him, uh, the Biju Janta Dal chief and chief minister Naveen Patnaik. Are they allies? Are they enemies? Remember, Odisha is going to have both assembly elections and Lok Sabha polls. And all of this has led to speculation at the moment whether Naveen Patnaik could possibly be even joining the NDA in Modi 3.0. Naveen Patnaik has uh, been Odisha Chief Minister for more than two decades. If he wins again, he will be India's longest serving Chief Minister. Uh, he has also in many polls been seen as the most popular Chief Minister in the country. Look at the latest Mood of the Nation poll of India today. He's one of those uh, unseen characters of Indian politics, not much discussed, but has been remarkably durable. Uh, hasn't lost a single election since he stepped into politics in the late 1990s. Now, the BJP and the Biju Janta Dal, what's the nature of their relationship? In Parliament, they've often worked in sync, but on the ground in Odisha, they've opposed each other. I want you to listen, though, that when the Prime Minister was in Odisha today, he didn't attack the Biju Janta Dal. Instead, he attacked the Congress Party. Listen in. ये कह रहे हैं कि मोदी का परिवार नहीं है और कह रहे हैं इसलिए मोदी को हटाना है इंडी गठबंधन के ये परिवारवादी कहते हैं कि इनकी लड़ाई विचारधारा की लड़ाई है इंडी अलायंस की विचारधारा फैमिली फर्स्ट है परिवार प्रथम है मोदी की विचारधारा है नेशन फर्स्ट राष्ट्र प्रथम सो व्हाट रियली इज गोइंग ऑन इन ओडिशा इज नवीन पटनायक इंचिंग एवर क्लोजर टू पॉसिबली बीइंग पार्ट ऑफ एनडीए वंस अगेन जॉइनिंग मी नाउ इज समवन हू नोज ऑल थिंग्स ईस्ट आर कोलकाता ब्यूरो चीफ इंदुजीत कुंडू जॉइंस अस इंदुजीत you know, when I look at all these images of the Prime Minister in Odisha and his attacks largely on the Congress, doesn't attack the Biju Janta Dal, what is one to read? There's much talk and speculation in the national capital that either before or most probably after the election, Naveen Patnaik intends to move even more closer to the BJP. What are you picking up? Well, absolutely. Even o Odisha politics right now is a buzz with speculation that uh, the BJD and BJP are going to come together once again. Though both camps, uh, you know, especially Biju uh, Janata Dal has gone on record saying that these are rumors. But trust me, there are talks that are underway between both these camps. And where are the talks stuck? They are stuck on seat sharing agreement because what we are given to understand is that the BJP is asking uh, quite a number of seats which the BJD or Naveen Patnaik's uh, party is not willing to share. Uh, Naveen Patnaik has been very clear in his approach to national politics. He wants to keep Odisha, his own state, insulated from the flux of national politics while maintaining a very good relationship with whichever party is in power at the center. And that happens to be Narendra Modi right now for the past two terms. And therefore, so, even when Prime Minister Modi was here today and a few days back, he has, uh, you know, spoken very favorably about Naveen Patnaik, say, uh, saying that, you know, uh, Lokpriya Chief Minister of Odisha, the other day he said, my friend Naveen ji. So it clearly shows that there is some olive branch being uh, given why, to Naveen Patnaik. The BJP would want... In, Indrajit, but why, why is Naveen Patnaik at this moment ready to do a deal with the BJP? What, what is it? What is in it? For him, the BJP obviously wants to shore up its numbers across the country and therefore wants as many allies at the moment. But what is in it for Naveen Patnaik? Uh, is he looking at, a, uh, at the BJP as a, a long-term ally? 
Well, uh, you know, the, the word that comes to my mind is stability. He doesn't want any sort of, uh, uh, you know, uh, any, any sort of flux. Look what is happening in adjacent to West Bengal, where it seems the Trinamool Congress government is continuously in a state of war against the central government, with governors uh, being deployed in opposition rule states to, uh, the allegation is that, to disturb the governments. These are things that are not there in Odisha right now, and Naveen Patnak has his own strategy and developmental measures that he wants, uh, you know, fast track, and therefore mm -hmm. he wants central schemes and central funds. It's quite a, uh, you know, uh, there has been quite an up, uh, upliftment of poverty in Odisha. There are tribal belt, so central funds are key to Odisha's development. Naveen Patnak doesn't want to disturb that. At the same time, politically, the BJP is a rising force. It's the principal opposition mm -hmm. party in the state. They got eight seats out of 21 Lok Sabha seats on offer. They are bargaining for 11 right now. Uh, if at all this alliance happens, we don't know. So therefore, Naveen Patnaik is very much aware that the BJP is a rising force. So therefore, mm -hmm. BJP needs to be curtailed to an extent. They are will the BJD, I'm told, Naveen Patnaik's mm -hmm. party is willing to concede ground uh, in the MP election, in the Lok Sabha election. When it comes to the Vidhan Sabha election, out of the 147 seats that are on offer, the BJD 112, and they don't want to concede anything Beyond that, they want to keep 100 seats to themselves and the rest 47 mm -hmm. seats can be handed over to the BJP, if at all. So in that sense, the BJT, BJD is playing smart. They want to consolidate because they know that is where the strength comes from at the state level. At the central level, they want to keep the... Uh, Naveen Patnaik wants very, to keep Odisha very, very interesting the flux on the central politics.